Thanks, Gianna. Here's a live look at SFO this morning where there's unfortunately a lot of drama. Yeah, your line's expected to be shuffling passengers for days now that a fleet of Boeing 737s is grounded. KPIX 5's Jackie Ward joining us live now. And that's not the only problem. Also, that powerful storm we've been following also posing problems. That's right, Ann. It's never easy traveling, is it? But despite all of those issues, people here at SFO seem to be dealing with these delays and cancellations pretty well so far. President Trump says this latest executive order intends to keep everyone safe. His emergency executive order that he issued yesterday now grounds. Boeing 737 MAX 8 and MAX 9 planes. As long as the cause of the fatal crash in Ethiopia is still undetermined, airlines are expected to be shuffling passengers for days as they adhere to this latest executive order. While it's still being investigated, lawmakers on Capitol Hill want to hear from Boeing. And passengers seem to be taking this all in stride, despite some delays possibly lasting days. You know what? I'd rather be stuck here than to take off and then never land. SFO is reporting 35 flights canceled. Flight Aware says 20 are canceled at Mineta and 11 at Oakland. Now, some of these are because of bad weather, like a horrific blizzard that's happening in Denver. But there are other cancellations scattered around California and Arizona. Primarily, Southwest American and United are the ones dealing with these delays and cancellations. They together are shuffling around six dozen of these 737s affected. At SFO, Jackie Ward, KPIX 5.